how did you decide to become an airline pilot or how did you decide to pursue pilot career to begin with to begin with uh, i did not even um, get a college application right after my high school i was very determined that i wanted to be a pilot high school did my ground training done and then flew to the us for my flight training but that was the most challenging part where when i completed my pilot training and got my pilot's license that's the time the indian market especially the aviation industry was in the downhill mode what was the year that it was, was in 2007 Absolutely. The most challenging <laughs> year for many of us. Yes. So the job opportunities in India was the biggest task. So Correct. with that note, did not want to stay idle. Wanted to keep myself consistent and current in flights. Uh, as we all know, being a pilot is not about getting a license and staying home to get Correct. a job. It's more Correct. important about how consistent are you. Absolutely. When was your last flight? That is the most million dollar question been asked Absolutely. by most of the airliners. Got it. With that note, I managed to find myself a flight instructor job back in the US in the same flight school and uh, pursued my flight instructor rating followed by airline transport pilot license. That's uh, great. Yes, in the US so I was there for almost four and a half years. Okay. And in my late teens that was <laughs> uh, <laughs> during my early 20s uh, i managed to find myself an first airline job in the far east okay so i got hired by the hong kong flag carrier okay as a second officer amazingly well beautiful 777 was on board as my first aircraft okay. as an airline oh it's so proud suited well just up with the hat walking so <laughs> proud as an early 20 boy again the challenge never stopped right they hit recession followed <laughs> um, indeed the expats are the first one to be expelled out if the country hits the recession Got so it. did hong kong yeah. Got it. so i had no other option than to exit the country again the persistence and the consistency towards the job and career was most important so I managed myself to fly again as an instructor but in a different genre <laughs> so i traveled to the uae okay again became a flight instructor in the uae but now not to train the civils but to train the military pilots oh, oh. wow so okay. that was quite uh, eye opener for me because i never knew that so much of an array is available in the flight instruction field okay okay so move to the uae <clears throat> still remember that was on uh, christmas evening where the entire world is celebrating but they were working <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> when i landed there for my flight check was wondering what is even happening but that was an amazing experience uh, got hired and started training military pilots now totally different new uniform wearing the overalls jumpsuits training the military pilots had a beautiful experience for again another 4 years in the UAE and uh now it's almost 8 years hmm. now Absolutely. really wanted to get back into airline because that's the view or the look up for many of the aspirants yeah. including me yeah. and uh, fortunately that's the time where the indian market started picking up correct now uh, managed to get myself an offer in the mm-hmm.